Greetings from the Fredericktown Homestead. All of these pieces here, on these two stacks, they were all wet the other day, so I put them up on their edge and I brought them in. Not because they're dry now. This beautiful, sunny, dry weather we've got. And underneath that, let me show you what I found. I knew I would. These are all wet, all these on their sides, and all the ones under them. My hope is that before the end of the day, maybe, or Sunday, whatever, soon, I can take in all these up on their sideboards, take a sticker off of them, and uh, by doing that, I end up with a new product that I'm... I'm uh, kind of stockpiling. It's uh, narrower than the three and a half by one sticker. And uh, it's a better product because when I cut stickers, I look at them carefully and I always take off the worst of the two sides. If there's any wane, see? If there's any wane, you see that wane? I take that off. And, uh, try and leave myself with nice clear wood. Can't always, but I can improve it by taking off the worst of it. By definition, if you take off the worst, you end up with something better. Uh, so that's my taking, and also I end up with these stickers, and stickers are uh, what I need in order to stack up this pile here. I'd kind of like to have enough stickers so that when I set into stacking this, sticking, sticking and stacking this here, it, um, I'll have enough stickers. Oh, boy. You just look over there at that compost pile with a nice green hat on top. Huh. Don't that just look special? I'm happy with that. Hey. Did I bring these three slats out here, these full length? Those are 48s. There was no 48s in this pile. I just don't know. Where did they come from? So I take a sticker off, and that gets them to this stage here. These have a sticker taken off. So that's the width that they'll be when, once they're, uh, I'm not showing you very well. That's these. Uh, they have one sticker taken off. And then they run through the planer and uh, that makes them like this. But see these each have one rough side. Uh, do they? Yes. They each have one rough side. And um, here's some more of the same thing. Oh no, these are clean four sides. Uh, do these have a sticker taken off? I don't know. Doesn't look like it. No. I think those are three and a half. Get the tape measure here. Yeah, those were three and a half. And, uh, huh. No, I've taken a sticker off of them because uh, there is one solid side. So that sticker I took was very nominal. It's only a quarter of an inch. You see that? I don't remember doing that. Taking a quarter inch off. I like taking off. When I set up myself to take stickers, what I do is I take one of these boards and I lay it right on the table saw between the fence and the blade, and I bring the blade right over so it's just the width of the width. And uh, width of the 
thickness and kind of make a square sticker that way like these. These are kind of square. Of course, the, the three and a half dimension of all these uh, slats varies. Let me just, uh, for giggles, these are ones fresh off the pile. Well, that's pretty close to three and a half. That's three and a half. Okay, so they come out pretty close to three and a half, but not always spot on. But once they've been across the table saw, they're all the same width. Whatever fits between the saw and here. And, uh, now, you see, if I had this emptied, then when I wanted to plane some, I could. Um, like, for instance, I might get a hankering to plane up these bunch here. Seems like... These are all pretty dry. They've been in here since uh, I think about February, maybe March. My table's not a drying rack. I gotta get all this stuff that I got stacked up against it either made into something, which would be nice, or. Uh, Stacked and stickered. I got the fan blown on the three quarter pile. And oh, don't that fan just feel, oh, that is heavenly on my back. Oh, I must have worked up a little bit of a sweat when I uh, mowed. Now what's this? Where did that come from? Huh. I don't know. I think it goes to the trash. How are you at guessing? Is that 16 feet in length, that chicken wire? If it all, do all I need is a new hog panel, or should I buy more chicken wire? Probably better buy more chicken wire, huh? Well. I think the next thing I'm going to do is cut stickers. Alright, God bless.